Okay, warm welcome to everyone. This is me Vishnu Desi. I am here with you to present experimental verification that is related to the triangle. At the previous classes, we have learned for experimental verification from the triangle. If you want to learn that experiment, video link is available in the description box. Okay, today we are going to learn last one experiment from the chapter triangle that is base angle of a right angle the isosceles triangle is 45 degree In this statement, a right angle isosceles triangle is given and to verify its base angle are 45 degree. Right angle isosceles triangle means a triangle having any two sides are equal and angle between them is 90 degree. Now we need to draw three right triangle isosceles triangle to construct right angle isosceles triangle draw a line segment of any length name of this line segment is AB then construct 90 degree at A or at B with the help of protector I am going to construct 90 degree at point A and join with the point A. then take a measure of compass same as the length of AB and cut down from the point A to this line and join that intersecting point with the B name of this point is C means line this line equals to this line this line equals to this line angle A is 90 degree means triangle ABC is right angle isosceles triangle in this triangle side AB equals to AC is oil is measure of angle A is right angle in this way construct next one right angle isosceles triangle a line segment of any length name of this line segment is AB and construct 90 degree at A with the help of protector then measure the length of compass same as the length of AB and cut down from the point A to this line we will get the intersecting point join this intersecting point with the ends B and name of this intersecting point is C length of AB equals to length of AC and A is 90 degrees Stock next one figure draw line segment of any length construct 90 degree at A Measure the length of compass, same as the length of AB and cut down from the point A to this line. The name of this intersecting point is C, join this point C with the point B. Length of AC equals to length of AB and A is exact 90 degree. Means this is also a right angle isosceles triangle. To verify base angle of a right angle isosceles triangle is 45 degree. AB and AC are equal. Get this figure. Angle C is opposite to the side AB. Angle B is opposite to the side AC. Angle C and angle B are base angle for this isosceles triangle. Angle opposite to the equal sides are base angle. Then we have to verify angle C equals to angle B equals to 45 degree. Angle ACB equals to angle ABC equals to 45 degree.
figure angle A C B angle A B C result from the first figure measure angle A C B with the help of protector A C B this one angle 45 degree A B C A B C this one this is also 45 means angle A C B equals to angle A B C equals to 45 now from the figure 2 angle A C B A C B this one angle Forty five A B C A B C this one forty five degree angle A C B equals to angle A B C equals to forty five degree. Now from the figure three angle A C B this one angle forty five degree. Now angle A B C A B C this one. This is 45. Angle ACB equals to angle ABC equals to 45. From this table, we conclude that base angle of a right angle isosceles triangle is 45 degree. Now, conclusion. And we have finished our experiment. We are going to learn experiment number 5 which is the opposite angles of a palm are equal. Cool. Experimentally verify that the opposite angles of a palm are equal. In this statement, a palm is given, a parallelogram is given, then we have to verify opposite angles are equal. To construct a palm, we need two square set and draw a line segment of any length at first and mark a point anywhere above this line segment like this. Then take a next square set and start to move from this tip towards the point like this. And take out next one square set and start to move from this tip towards the point like this. And draw the line segment like this. Means given lines, this one and this one lines are parallel. In this way, try to draw next one figure of parallel line once again. Draw line segment like this. And mark a point anywhere above the line segment. And start to move next one square set from the stiff towards the point as previous. and take out set and move from this tip towards the point as previous okay then draw line segment means these two lines are also parallel to each other suppose, suppose a b c d a b c d is a palm because opposite sides are parallel to each other in this figure Line AB is parallel to DC and AD is parallel to BC. Given figure one. In this way, construct next one palm. Draw line segment of any length and mark a point anywhere above this line segment like this. 
and start to move next one square set from this stiff towards the point like this and take out previous one square set start to move from this stiff towards the point and draw a line segment like this means these two lines are parallel to each other in this way try to draw next one fear of parallel line at first you can draw line segment as your wish and mark a point above this line segment and start to move next one square set from the steep towards the point as previous and take out next one square set and start to move from the steep towards the point like this and draw line segment which is also parallel a b c d in this way try to construct next one farm draw line segment of in length and mark point mark a point anywhere above this line segment like this and start to move next one square set from the this one end like this and take out previous one square set and start to move from this step towards the point you can extend this one line is your need this is parallel to the previous line then try to construct next one figure of parallel line at first you can take a line segment anywhere and mark a point then start to move next one square set from the steep towards the point like this take out previous one square set and start to move from the steep towards the point like this and line segment means given line is parallel to the given line a b c d now given a b c d is a pump this is given to verify opposite angles are equal means this angle equals to this angle at first angle B A D B A D equals to angle B C D to prove next one to prove is this angle equals to this angle angle A B C angle A B C equals to angle A D C now measurement table Here, angle B A D B A D this one angle angle B C D this one angle angle B A B C C this one angle then A D C A D C result then measure all the four angles of each parallelogram by using protector from the first figure angle B A D B A D this one angle 70 degree angle B C D B C D this one angle this is also 70 degree then angle A B C A B C this one angle and this figure B C is here and A B is here measurement between these two line is 110 degree 110 degree now angle A D C a D C this one angle. This is also 110 degree. Now result angle B A D equals to angle B C D my angle 
A, B, C equals to angle A, D, C. Now from figure 2, angle B, A, D, B, A, D, this one angle, 110 degree. Now angle B, C, D, B, C, D, this one angle, 110 degree. Angle A, B, C, A, B, C, this one angle, 70 degree. Angle A, D, C, A, D, C, this one, 70 degree. That means angle B, A, D equals to angle B, C, D equals to angle A, B, C equals to angle A, D, C. Now from the figure 3, angle B, A, D, B, A, D, this one angle. 105 degree angle BCD BCD this is also 105 angle ABC ABC this one 75 now angle ADC this one 75 degree that means angle B A D equals to angle B C D angle A B C equals to angle A D C from this measurement table we conclude that opposite angles of a palm are equal this angle equals to this angle this angle equals to this angle Our conclusion Okay, we have finished our experiment. I hope all of you are understood. This one is very well. If you have any confusion, you can leave your question in the comment section below. Uh, if you like my video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. See you in next video. Bye-bye.